Hi there, motor homeowners. Today we're going to be taking a look at ADCO's line of deluxe windshield covers. Now you will want to make sure that you use our fit guide to get the appropriate windshield cover for your motor home. These are like a semi-universal fit where there's about 10 different options and across those 10 options, each one is designed to fit certain series of motorhomes. So we're showing off the one here that's closely designed to fit the 550 series motorhomes. And we can see here that we've got it. And it's, it is again a semi-universal fit, but it does give us a full encompass all the way around our side windows, across the front and to the other side. And with this being the deluxe option, it's more than just a cover for your windshield. It actually is a privacy screen as well built into it, which has a couple of different functions for you to enjoy inside. And just to show off the semi-custom fit nature of these covers, we're going to show it off here on both an E450 Class C motorhome and an F550 Class C motorhome. And this is the exact same cover we'll be using on both. And if you're comparing the two, you can see here that on the E450, the cover does fit a little bit better than it does on our 550. The 550 really stretches it to its maximum size, whereas with this one here, it's got a little bit of leeway left, so it does drape over it very nicely. So here you can see that you get nice privacy screening with the mesh here. I can barely tell that there's an individual on the other side here filming me, but I can't really make out what's going on. So this can be really useful if you're just hopping in here, maybe you're getting ready to hit the beach or something, you need to change clothes real quick, but uh, you still like getting the airflow throughout your motorhome. The window's currently down, so this acts as a screen to help keep out some of the larger bugs. And it does a great job of blocking uh, looking inside and again, lets that airflow through. In the event that you don't feel that you have enough privacy though, you can go ahead and pop the sides here off of the little roller. They have little latches that allows you to roll them up and this will just fold back up into place and the hook and loop fasteners will secure it. And now you've got complete privacy. As I walk around the outside here, you can see me across the front. I can barely see that there's some movement on the inside, but I really can't make out what it is. And we've got full protection even here on the other side. This one also lowers down, so you can lower down both sides as necessary, whichever works best for your situation. And at first glance, I was a little worried about this being a wraparound cover. A few of the things that I was wondering is, can I still get in and out of the vehicle while this is on? Now, I think that is gonna slightly depend on your motor home. This one hangs high enough where it doesn't cover up any of our door latches, so we can still access the door latch. I could see where maybe on some models that have maybe a handle up here in the pillar where the cover might obstruct it some. The door does still open though, you can still access it. However, on this one, with it being such a big motor home, you can really only open the door about that far. It's starting to pull on our cover, and if we open this up, it does have the potential of damaging the cover if we open it any further. But this is plenty enough for us to be able to get inside. We can do what we need to do. You can shut the door. Whatever we need to do on our motorhome, we're ready to uh, get back out again once we've done whatever we needed to do. And you can see our full window covers here on the side. You can see where the stitches are for the various hook and loop fasteners that hold it up. There are plenty in there to ensure that it does stay up, even in a higher wind situation. We've got our screen mesh behind it and the flap that we can expose our screen with. You just take it here and you can roll it up. There's a couple of hook and loop fasteners right there that we can bring around the side to hold this up so it's not flapping in the wind or obstructing your access to any of your entryway handles. And this same side cover that we've got here is on the other side and also here on our front windshield as well. A lot of people really like that it has the screen mesh here. So you can open this up, roll your window down on the inside and enjoy a nice cool breeze without letting insects and things like that enter in easily. In addition to the screen keeping out bugs, the entire cover here is going to reduce the amount of sunlight that's going into your motorhome. That'll help keep it cooler on those hotter days, especially in the summertime when you've got a lot of sun exposure for long periods of time. It'll also help protect your dash here because those harmful UV rays that the sun's emitting will dry out the material on your dash and start it to fade and cause cracking. So if we can prevent those rays from hitting directly on our dash, whether it's broken up from the mesh here or from the entire cover, that'll greatly extend the life of our dash because that's something you see pretty common on vehicles that sit outside. Even after only five to 10 years, you can really have a lot of sun damage on your dash material. The material of our cover is gonna be a highly durable automotive grade vinyl. 
and that way it can protect our vehicle from any kind of scratches or abrasions when it's kind of sitting out of your campsite. Sometimes little tiny limbs and things like that fall. This can help keep that from dinging up around the outside and keeping that debris from filling up down here in your grill area. The bottom side of our cover has a breathable material that will prevent it from building mildew and mold on the inside. And like with the side windows, the front one here just unrolls as well. You just undo your hook and loop fasteners there. And we just bring this up and you match up your hook and loop fasteners on the outer cover with the ones here on the windshield. And we just do this all the way across on these bigger motorhomes where they're tall. It can be a little difficult to reach the center ones there. So you might need a little step ladder or something. Or a lot of times you can step on the side step here on your vehicle and use that to give you the boost you need. And you can see it really wasn't that difficult. We didn't really need to even get up to the center there. Just kind of pulling it taut was enough to give us the contact we needed on our fasteners to get it up there. So you can see where this would be useful in both storage or for camping. For storage, you've got complete privacy here. You can leave these up all the time while it's in storage. The vinyl is going to be an extra protective layer because maybe um, where you're storing it, a lot of people out here in Missouri, they just uh, they find a, a lot somewhere that has a gravel lot and they just leave it there during the winter. And here we get hail and other things during those winter months. And this could potentially be the difference between a ding on your windshield or not having one because this vinyl is going to help disperse any kind of impacts across the fabric to minimize it where it hits on the vehicle. For camping settings, it's also really nice because you can use it for full privacy with all the covers up. Uh, it's really nice when it's especially hot out because this can keep the sun's rays out, keeping it cool inside. And then you have the option for the screen if you wanted to add in a little bit of natural light while still maintaining some privacy. And you can even open up your side windows to let a cross breeze through. To begin our installation, we're going to throw this over our hood here, making sure that our hook and loop fasteners for our mirror are down towards the bottom. We'll lift it up. We're going to put it over our mirror, snap those in, open the doors, hook it over the door, and place our magnet at the bottom. We just come in a little closer here to show you the magnets. It does have some heft and weight to it, so that gravity will help keep it down, and then the magnet will grab onto the side of your vehicle here to help keep it in place. You can see the back side here still has the vinyl material on it instead of the, uh, the breathable material, and that'll help prevent it from causing any scratches or abrasions on the vehicle. If we open up the door, we can see the top here hooks around the door. This little loop here goes around both the top and the bottom to help keep it tight as well and keep it from slipping down. It has this on both sides and of course you've got your fasteners here around your mirror as well. And that completes our look at Adco's line of deluxe windshield covers.